welcome back to my channel. You are probably wondering by the title for all of you that are subscribers of mine, what the heck am I doing with another mystery box? And you would be correct in thinking that because I didn't like my last one and I said I wasn't gonna do a new one, but uh, per usual, this is YouTube and this is me. I'm doing another one. For all of you that are new here, welcome. My name is Brittany. I do videos all the time. Also, Merry Early Christmas. I am in the Christmas mood. I've been watching Hallmark movies for the past month already. I've been saying Merry Christmas for a while and annoying the heck out of people. The tree needs spotlighted. It is the star of this video, not me. That's why I'm off center. <laughs> I have a Christmas mystery box, not from eBay. Also, there is a hole in it. Made me think someone was peeking inside a little early. It wasn't me. This is from an actual store though. It is not from eBay, but it is a mystery box. It's called the Christmas box and right now they're doing a pre-launch. I don't know for sure if you can still buy them. Um, I don't know if they're sold out yet. I will have everything in the down bar if you wanna check them out. Um, but they only do it one time a year. So it's not like a subscription box by any means. You just buy it once. They ship out the day after Thanksgiving and it's literally a year pre-order. So if you wanna get one of these for next year, you're gonna have to order it soon. I know that sounds crazy, but if you think about it, it's gonna have a year of thought put into it. Everything in here is, nothing's gonna be trash. Everything is going to be over the value and all Christmas themed. So all of you crazies like me that love Christmas, this is for you. I'm starting to sweat, let's open this. The spring light is very bright. There are two different options, the $34 box and a $49 box. I don't exactly know which one I'm getting right now um, because this was a pre-launch for bloggers and vloggers and I got lucky enough to make that list. So I'm gonna show it to you guys. Oh, it's all packaged really, really well. So straight in, I'll grab that, is a ton of bubble wrap. Chester will probably be down here any second when he hears this. It says, look what the North Pole's mystery box department sent you. Hope this large, this is a $49 one, Christmas box brings you joy and put you in the perfect holiday mood. Your box is worth more than $80. Oh, that's so cool they put that on there so you know exactly. That means I don't have to calculate it, which is great. And Chester is here, I'll pick him up when I can. Okay, the first thing is, I wanna guess, this is like something it looks like you hang it. It looks like an ornament. It is. It's too little. Oh, these are going to be so cute. I didn't. I don't know why I didn't realize they were going to send decorations. Two little ornaments to hang like on the wall. I'm going to put this in my bedroom, I think. That are in like the front hallway. That is so adorable. I'm not buying anything this year for Christmas decoration wise. You know, I'm about to lie. Once Christmas is over and the clearance comes out, I'm going to buy a lot of stuff. Um, that way, when I have my new place next year for Christmas, I won't have to, you know, spend a ton, ton of money. I probably still will, but it'll be cheaper. He's here. He's here for the bubble wrap. The next thing is a centerpiece for your dining table, or actually I need something in like this area here, but it's a little gingerbread village. And then we have Better Homes salt and pepper shakers. These are in the shape of pine cones and they are adorable. And that way when anyone comes over to my house and they see I have salt and pepper shakers, Christmas themed, they'll know exactly how crazy I am. Which is perfect because it's fitting. Snow Baby Celebration Special Holiday Program. The song making so that Snowbird Sing Me a Song. I'm like really sweating right now. I feel like I look like Miranda a little bit. So what this is, is a little like figurine. Not as much into the figurine game, I'll be honest. This is a little more grandma-ish for, for me, but I can pass this on as a gift to a grandma, my mom, anyone that puts little figurines out. It's cute though. I just like have the urge to smash this for some reason. I'm not, don't worry. I wonder if there'll be like a candle in here. Oh, oh, it's a little, um, what do you call that? Like a lantern holder, a little candle votive holder. You stick a little candle in there. I wonder if there will be a candle. I don't know. I'm, I have like a billion I can put in here. Oh, here the candles are. So it's a little candle holder 
You see why I thought it was dirty? I think it might just need either cleaned out or it's supposed to look like there's snow in there, one or the other. And then it comes with three candles and they smell like vanilla. And the next thing is a little ornament and it says, Santa says ornament and it says define good, which is me. And the very last is this chocolate. What is this? No, it's not chocolate. I got excited. This is the O oh Christmas tree and I don't know what it is. What? I still don't know. What is this? A fragrance light? No. What? Never heard. Have you guys heard of this? So it's showing a photo of you putting it over a light bulb, I'm assuming like a lamp or something, and then you putting fragrance into the ring so then when the lamp, which we do have a lamp, is hot, it scents up. I've never seen this before. I'm a little concerned about it. I'm gonna try it, yeah. A review of the box. It's fun. I love opening presents. I think though that this specific box, although none of them are the same, it did kind of revolve around a more mature theme. And for me, I think I would have liked a little more like fun, bright stuff. And it was a lot of traditional things. I think someone like 35 and over would appreciate this more than like a younger person and definitely not a teenager. Christmas obsessed people in general though will love this, even if they are younger. I loved opening this. Is everything gonna match what I have in my mind of like what theme I wanna do? Absolutely not, but a lot of it does. I think my favorite thing in the box is gonna go to the pine cone salt and pepper shakers because like it's very extra and that's completely okay with me. Oh, actually the sparkly ornaments too. The very first thing I pulled out, I really like those. Anyways, that is all for this Christmas unboxing. I hope you enjoyed it. If you want me to do another mystery box, Leave me what kind, make it weird, not too weird. And I'm gonna head out, I need to go to the gym, I need to take this lipstick off because I feel weird. And I will see you guys really soon, don't forget to subscribe if you're not already, it's free and I love you very, very much. Bye.